Beijing Daxing International Airport Chinese, Beijing Da Xing Guo Ji Ji Chong Pinyin, Beijing Daxing Go Ji Ji Chong IATA, Unknown, ICAO, ZBAD, located on the border of Beijing and Longfang, Hebei Province, is Beijing's second international airport and is currently under construction. The name of the airport was announced on September 14, 2018. The terminal building is expected to be completed on June 30, 2019, and the airport is expected to be open on September 30, 2019. Upon completion, it will serve as a major international hub airport in northern China. With four runways, 268 parking bays, and a 700,000 square meter terminal area, the airport is expected to be the world's largest airport upon completion. The new airport is also expecting a total of seven runways in the future in order to accommodate 620,000 flights and 100 million passengers each year. The new airport is 46 kilometers south of Tiananmen Square, 26 kilometers west of downtown Longfang City, 50 kilometers northeast of Chang'an New Area, and 65 kilometers from the existing Beijing Capital International Airport, and is expected to serve Beijing, Tianjin, and Hebei. It will serve as a hub for SkyTeam Alliance Airlines, while Star Alliance members will stay at the existing Beijing Capital International Airport. It is unclear where Hainan Airlines, which accounted for 10% of Beijing Capital International's passenger seat capacity in 2016 but is not part of any major alliance, will be located. After the transition, Beijing Nanyuan Airport currently solely served by China United Airlines will be closed once the new airport is completed. Design The airport's master plan was designed by airport consulting firm NACO and will feature a ground transportation center providing the airport with public transportation links to high-speed rail, metro, expressways, Beijing airport bus routes, local buses and inter-airport transportation system. The terminal building was designed by ADPI in collaboration with Zaha Hadid Architects and other consultants. It will consist of a central hub with six curved spokes. Hong Kong Design Studio Lead 8 was appointed as lead designer of the commercial terminal in 2018. The terminal, according to Lead 8, will encompass a purposeful design of workspaces, with integrated retail, dining, and entertainment options for the large number of passengers expected. With plans to incorporate interactive pet hotels, a child care and nursery, hybrid online retail and dining, and a showroom for companies. <laughs> Airport facilities The first phase of the airport project is designed with a target of 72 million passengers, 20 million tons of cargo and mail, and 620,000 aircraft movements in 2025, with plans to handle 100 million passengers in the long term. <laughs> Ground transportation Intercity rail A new high-speed railway service, the beijing Chang'an Intercity Railway, is under construction and will start from Beijing West Railway Station. It will connect the urban area of Beijing, Daxing District of Beijing, the new airport, Bajou, and finally Chang'an. The section between the airport to Beijing will operate at speeds of 250 km per hour and the section between the airport to Chang'an will operate at speeds of 350 km per hour, cutting the end-to-end -end journey time between the two cities to about 30 minutes and Beijing to the airport in about 11 minutes. The airport to Beijing section is expected to open in September 2019 while the airport to Chang'an section in late 2020. Another intercity railway, the Capital Airport to Beijing New Airport Intercity Railway Connector, Shou Do Ji Chang Ji Beijing Xin Ji Chang Sheung Ji Tai Lu Lian Luo Xi'an will connect Longfang, Yijuang, Beijing Sub Administrative Center in Tongzhou District and Beijing Capital International Airport to the new airport. Phase 1 of the Intercity Railway Connector new airport to Longfang East Railway Station is under construction. The Phase 1 of the railway will be finished in June 2022. The speed will be 200 km per hour. Subway 
The new airport line of the Beijing subway is currently under construction. The line will connect the airport to the urban area of Beijing. It will be opened in September 2019. In long-term plan of Beijing subway, Line 20 line R4 of the Beijing subway is planned to terminate at the new airport. <laughs> <laughs> development history A second airport for Beijing was proposed in 2008. By 2012, the existing Beijing Capital International Airport was running at near its full design capacity. <inaudible> <inaudible> Initial proposals Early media reports during September 2011 suggested that there could be up to nine runways, eight runways for civil aviation plus one runway dedicated to military usage. It would replace Beijing Capital International Airport which had 83 million passengers in 2013, second most in the world as the main airport of Beijing and the largest in China and was being planned as a domestic-only airport. The airport was planned to be able to handle 120 to 200 million passengers a year, which, if capacity were fully used, would make it the world's busiest airport by passenger traffic, surpassing Hartsfield-Jackson Atlanta International Airport by far. Topic. Approval for construction Official approval for construction by the Chinese State Council and officials was given on Sunday 13 January 2013. It called for an airport to be constructed in the southern part of Daxing District of Beijing, along the border of Beijing and Hebei Province. No design or plans were released due to ongoing negotiations. It was stated that it would consist of seven runways, six for civilian use and one for military purposes. Construction is expected to be completed in September 2019 with a capacity of handling 75 million passengers by 2025. The estimated cost of construction is at least 70 billion RMB, 11.2 billion dollars, including the 37 kilometers, 23 miles beijing shangan Intercity Railway, Beijing section to Beijing West Railway Station. Topic. Construction Construction of the airport began on December 26, 2014. By March 2017, the terminal had its concrete structure capped. In December 2017, hundreds of Qing dynasty tombs were discovered during construction. Topic. Service development It was initially planned for airlines of the SkyTeam Alliance to be relocated to the new airport, while Star Alliance Airlines would remain at Capital, effectively making both airports hubs. This was confirmed in 2016, when the Civil Aviation Administration of China announced that China Southern Airlines, China Eastern Airlines and Xiamen Airlines along with other SkyTeam Airlines would move to the new airport, while Air China and other Star Alliance carriers would remain at Capital. China Southern, China Eastern and Beijing Capital Airlines' intentions to move to Daxing were confirmed by a Xinhua report in December 2017. Among One World carriers, American Airlines has indicated plans to relocate flights from Capital to Daxing due to its tie-up with China Southern, but Cathay Pacific and Cathay Dragon reportedly intend to stay at Capital. Nine passenger airlines, China Southern Airlines, China Eastern Airlines, including China United Airlines and Shanghai Airlines, Beijing Capital Airlines, Hebei Bay Airlines, Spring Airlines, OK Airways, Junyao Airlines, Xiamenair and Donghai Airlines and one cargo airline China Postal Airlines signed agreements with the Capital Airport Group to enter the new airport. <laughs> <laughs> airlines and destinations Planned <laughs> 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 <laughs>